Imagine a world that depends on you to save every baby animal in Minecraft. As you save each baby animal, you'll face mutant spiders, blazing fires, and even terrifying floods. Can I brave these conditions and save every baby animal in Minecraft before it's too late? Stay tuned to find out. <sighs> what is that noise? It's so cute. It's a sheep saying hi or saying, ah. oh, I think it's from this way. Wait, wait, is it trapped in the cobwebs? No. Oh, poor baby. That's why it's screaming. So we're going to use our stone sword and try to help save this sweet little sheep. Oh, we've got it. We've got it. I'm a little slow because this is stone, but we can do it. I know. Calm down. Calm down. Oh, you're so cute. Ah, 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 ah. Don't eat the spider. Don't eat the sheep. The spider has engulfed the baby sheep. We have only one thing we can do. Kill it. Not the sheep, but the spider. Yeah, that's right. You run away in shame. You're being me to a baby. Oh, oh, hi. Why do I have wheat already in my pocket? It's like I knew I would come across a stray stuck sheep and save it and give it food to make it feel better. I don't know. It's like this was planned. Oh my gosh, it was lost from its mom. I feel like a hero. This video just started and I've reunited a baby sheep with its mother. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find a celebratory snack and also try not to cry as I leave them because I'm already emotionally attached. Oh my goodness. God. I decided to head to the beach and look at this little tiny baby sea turtle. Oh my gosh, I can't, I can't. It's so cute. He's not responding to me though. Is this another sheep situation? I'm a Christian woman and I feel like God has brought me here to save these baby animals. Let me get my scanner. Uh, ah, turtle status, hungry, dry, injured, flipper. Dude, what have you been through? I have heard before that when baby turtles hatch on the sea, on the beach, it's a struggle to make it to the sea. Well, conveniently, I have a bucket, a bandage, and a magnifying glass. It's like, yet again, this was supposed to happen. <laughs> Comedy. Now, first, I know I'm not nice when I'm hungry, so I'm gonna grab some kelp and just hope that's what a fish eats. Was that kelp? Oh no, I don't know what kelp looks like. Uh, this one? This one, this one, this one, this. Eventually, there we go. I got it, I got it, I got it. He's so small, he doesn't probably need this much. Here I am to save the day. Sheldon, you're going to be okay. First, I'm gonna feed you. He's so cute. Then I'm going to, uh, uh, oh, get you water because you're dry. Easy. Oh, he's looking great already. Now we are going to uh, grab some sponge. I need to create a waterproof band-aid because like he's in the water. It would soak off. So we just have to combine these two things, waterproof bandage, and now I can use my magnifying glass and see what the problem really is. Oh. Oh, what happened? It's okay, we have a bandage and it will solve everything. Okay, here we are. This bandage is solving every problem. Sheldon should be good now. Did he get bigger or is that just me? Oh, he went back in the beach. Hold on, don't leave me, I love you. He's so cute, oh my gosh. I basically am now an animal whisperer and I'm prepared for whatever I need to whisper to next. Okay, my spider senses are tingling and I feel like I just heard a cat. There's definitely a cat outside somewhere. It better not be Eloise. Eloise, if you went outside, I'm going to be thoroughly disappointed in you. I thought I heard it. Am I crazy? Yeah. Where is it? Hold on. I don't know if you can see it, but it's literally up in this tree. I don't even know how to point it out to you because it's so small. It's another baby. See, 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 top right, top right. I am a cat mother. I am the mother of cats, so I know how to lure a cat. You get some fish and you try to be nice to it. Wait, 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 wait. Do you see? It's trying to climb down. It's coming closer to me. Hey, 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 little guy. Oh, why? He got scared again. What about this? Can I get in the tree this way? Here we go. Up here, up here. Oh, I can't get tall enough. Hold on, let's push it over this way like so and now I just have to bounce my way to the cat oh I don't think I'm close enough still <gasps> ah, I just heard him yell hold on I'm coming for you I just have to get some momentum with this trampoline okay 
Okay, Bree, you got this. You just gotta click on the cat. I feel like I have such a huge responsibility for all of mankind right now. Bree, click him. Click him. Ah! I got him. I got him. He is stuck in my head. I. What is happening? This is not good for the cat's health or mine. Let's get off this trampoline ah! and give him a snack. And literally, why? He's literally like a spear through my head. We're both traumatized. Here, little kitten. Let's go, dear. Oh, they're all so cute. Cute. Here's this. And you need some milk because every cat needs milk when they've had a traumatizing day. I don't know if Eloise will want a friend, but no, 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 please stay. Even though Eloise won't like you, I love you. I now feel like I'm the proud mother of a sheep, a turtle, and a cat. Comment down below, what is your favorite Minecraft animal? Oh my gosh, this barn is on fire? Or it is, it's glistening. No, there is fire in there. Oh my gosh, it's a barn. There is probably another animal in need of help. Let's see. Can anyone in here? <coughs> uh, um, oh, oh, can I get some water? I need some, a puddle, a puddle. Fill the bucket, fill the bucket and put out the flames. That's what I have to do. Bree, you are gonna save more lives. So far, I don't see, oh, there's a baby horse. There's a baby horse. It's okay, you're going to be okay. We're gonna save you. Ignore all the water that I'm pouring. We're trying to uh, get all the flames to go away. Making progress. If this was baby Preston, guys, I'm never gonna forgive him. Like I, animals are my favorite thing in the entire world. And you can't set a barn on fire. <laughs> Okay, most of the fire is gone at this point, but I'm getting a really bad cough from being in all the smoke. Oh my gosh, okay, I think this is the last stall that has fire in it. Let's save the horse, okay? Everything done, done? Oh my gosh, the ceiling is on fire. Are you kidding me? How am I supposed to reach up there? Okay, good thing for ladders. Second floor, here I come. I literally had no idea. Okay, this is going much quicker, ladies and gents. I'm becoming a professional firefighter. I have once played as a firefighter in Minecraft, so if you haven't seen it, you should check it out. I saved numerous lives. Okay, up the last ladder to hopefully find the last flame. Three, two, one. Fire extinguished. Oh my gosh, I need a glass of water. It's hot, I'm tired, but we gotta save Charlie. Charlie horse, I know you are over here and we are going to be best friends. Hi. Oh, oh no, it doesn't like me. Please come back. Oh my gosh, I can't lose you. Do you have anything? A barrel, a barrel of carrots. Carrots, carrots, carrots. Let's hold it in our hand and make Charlie love us. Here you go. Oh my gosh, the stable is totally burnt. I can rebuild it. I have to make him a home. You can't just leave him without a home. So let's see, build four parts of the stable. Ah, what? Oh no, this is a build battle. I have to rebuild this part of the barn. So uh, this guy's does not actually look that easy to me. <gasps> yes, I barely made it. Okay, this one doesn't look as bad, right? Oh no, there's a lot of pieces to this one. I'm gonna be honest, it would be, you know, a lot simpler if I could look at the pre-existing floor plan while I did this, guys. It, it would just be, it would help me a lot. And, and you know, I'm trying to help the horse. So helping me helps the horse. One. One, two, yes. Second out of four, only two more. Oh gosh, this one looks very complicated. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. I just have to figure out exactly how tall this thing is. That's what takes me a while. Now I just need to place in the barrels very quickly. We are almost out of time and I still have some red concrete left. And that goes right here. And do, 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 do. yes, that one was hard guys. Okay, so Charlie was successfully boarded back in the stable, but now I hear a dog. Do I smell weird? I'm like attracting animals. I don't know what's happening. I think he's at my door. Where's, okay. Apparently I don't know my house enough to even know where my front door is. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a little embarrassing. Oh, hi. It's a baby too. Oh, it's super wet. It needs, oh, it is going in my house. Sir, I didn't invite you in, but you're an adorable puppy. So like, you gotta, you, you gotta get in. Motley, you are very wet and dirty. Let me go in my bathroom. I'm sure I have a towel somewhere. I have a towel. I was near the bathroom and I keep it in a beautiful chest with flowers. So it smells lovely. Here you go, buddy. 
Oh, he is sparkling. I wish you could just rub a towel on me and I would just be sparkly clean. That would be amazing. Now I gotta clean my floor. I could be irritated, but I am looking at a puppy. So like, to be honest, if you can be irritated while looking at a puppy, I can't trust you. We just can't be friends. Just got a wet towel. I do this all the time. Preston leaves footprints everywhere and you know, I just... I bet you're hungry. That's why you are staring and not moving. You need energy to go on. Lucky for us, we have a raw chicken. I don't know if dogs like chicken. I assume they do. I've actually never had one. So let's see. He looks even more beautiful. Somebody's got to be looking for you, though, because you are so beautiful. So let me know it. I'm going to make a missing poster. A missing dog poster. We have paper and ink. I just heard you bark, Motley. It's fine. I'm coming. I will be your mother if you want me to be, but I'm sure you already have somebody who's looking for you. Here we go. Let's make a missing poster. Five dog found posters. Let's go post them up all over the neighborhood. People got to make sure. Wait, Motley, before I go hang these, I need your autograph. Thank you. They are worth even more now because they are signed by Motley himself with his beautiful paw print. So I'm just gonna hang them up all over. People need to make sure. I mean, I don't typically like when strangers stop by my house, but at this moment, I am only caring about the wellness and health of this puppy. They've all been placed. And there is already a woman at my house. Now that is either lucky or creepy. I, I literally just put that up. Why were you so close to my house, pet owner, if that is your real name? Hi, I found the posters. I'm the owner of this dog. I just showed you the paw print. Can I really trust you? He is an amazing companion. You may be trying to take him away from me. He ran away while it was raining because he was scared. Oh, dang it, it is. I mean, I'm happy for them and all. Thank you, you're welcome. I'm, I'm happy for you, but I also was gonna be okay with keeping Toto. Where's Chuckles? Oh my gosh, I don't have him with me right now. This is fulfilling my need to be with a chicken. Um, he's looking around like he's lost. Okay, this is chicken speak for I am lost. Where's your mom? I need to find the mother chicken. I have lost Chuckles enough that I have created an invention that is brand new and I'm going to use it to help the baby chicken today. We are going to simply combine a bell, a stick, a trip wire and some wheat seeds and we have a chicken contraption. Now, this will lure the mother chicken towards us and it will ring when she steps on it. Little little man, I'm gonna stay with you overnight because I don't want you to get eaten by a wolf. Oh, oh, wait, it worked. You could barely see her, but she's flapping. They call me the chicken whisperer. I'm just gonna say at this point, I've pretty much helped save all of the Minecraft animals. Oh, oh this baby pig is either uh, having a staring contest or he doesn't feel good. And I can't, yep, it definitely doesn't feel good. This cow led me here for a reason. Oh no. There is a half eaten red mushroom on the ground and take five red flowers. Red mushrooms are very poisonous to pigs. So we only have a certain amount of time that we can save him if we get Five red flowers, five. Now what else? Take one milk bucket. Cow, get back here. Bessie, Bessie, I love you. Thank you. Now we need a glass bottle. Take one fern. I don't remember what a fern looks like. I have now Googled what a fern looks like in Minecraft so I can make sure I find it in time, but I literally don't feel like I'm having any luck. Okay, now it's time for the shears. Grab a fern. Now I need to take one honey bottle. Oh no, I don't want to die. Three, two, one. Oh, that was easy. Six berries. Excuse me, Henrietta. Where are the berries? Where are the berries? I have a very sick pig to take care of. Okay, here we are. Berry, berry. How many do I have? Oh, oh, ingredients obtained. I have the antidote. Now let's go save the pig. You're going to be okay. Oh my gosh. I've never seen a baby pig in Minecraft. It's so cute. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Hey, let's be buddies. Since the pig wouldn't stay with me, I decided I'm gonna walk home. But I'm in the forest, it's a little scary, and there are tons of cows. Wait, what's this? This little guy's limping, what's wrong? Uh-oh, um, okay, I see an arrow in his leg, I think. I have a sleeping flower, I'm prepared for surgery. Here you go, buddy, you just need to smell this. Let me, I have a sleeping flower, it's gonna make you feel better, and then I can help you. Let's just, hey, right, look at this. <gasps> Did I kill him? 
No, Bree, you forgot. You gave him a sleeping flower. Now I gotta use your stethoscope. And yeah, he has a lot of splinters in his leg. A lot of them. So let's use our pliers. Okay, only two more splinters to go. No wonder he was limping. Arrow removed. Now place the bandage. Oh, I have to cover this entire thing? That's a lot of bandages. Hopefully this makes him feel better. And we should be good now. Hi, little guy. Can you stand now? Yay! It looks like he's doing good. Do, 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 do. Oh, oh, help us. I don't know Minecraft language. Okay, don't hate. But little oinkers needs our help. And uh, we're gonna do it. If you guys don't know me, I love animals. So this is a challenge made for me. Our helicopter is coming. Are you going with us? Rescue team radio. Um, how did you hear me? Ah! I think there's a spy camera somewhere. They were just hovering. They were like, Brie loves animals. We're gonna get her with this super depressing poster. Will you be an angel for a helpless animal? I am going with you, but is this thing big enough to uh, carry me? Comment down below if you've ever ridden a helicopter. I did once and it was terrifying. Yes, I am coming with you. <laughs> Hold on. I don't think this is supposed to happen. I'm strapped to the side of a helicopter. Save the walrus. Okay, you have to help this walrus by fixing the ice bridge. Also, he's surrounded by some bears, so you'll need to deal with them too. Be aware, ice is melting everywhere and bears can be very dangerous. There's a lot going on in this mission. So we have packed ice to replace the melting ice as well as a freezing rifle. Used to freeze dangerous polar beasts. These are not even polar bears? Oh no, there's a polar beast in front of us. Freeze! Cool party. Don't worry, it doesn't hurt them because they like being in the cold. They're just unable to move for a little bit so we can save the walrus. Boing. So we just have to move this way and make sure none of the polar beasts follow us. Ah! That was almost bad. Where are they? I know there's multiple out here, okay? I wasn't born yesterday. I feel like there might be a sneak attack happening. <gasps> There we go. Three bears have been frozen. There's this guy down here. And maybe that's it? Oh no, there's one more in the distance. Man, this is kind of difficult because it's all ice. Oh, I just missed him. I just missed him. We're gonna have to get a little closer. Ice parkour is a little harder than uh, regular parkour. Oh, I thought I froze them all. I didn't, but we are one step closer to the bridge that contains Wally the Walrus. Fix the ice. You have to replace the melting ice. Okay, we have packed ice in here. So just break these. We don't need them and replace them with the good stuff. There's there's kind of a lot of this. I get why it would not be safe for a walrus to walk on this bridge. What does a walrus do? Scoot? Flop? I'm not quite sure. It's a mystery wrapped in a riddle inside an enigma. Also, it's going to be really bad if I accidentally step on that because I'm going to go straight through into the Arctic Ocean. I'm not a good enough swimmer for that. We're getting close. But bad news, bears, there is a bear very close to us. So we're about to have to freeze him. So far, they haven't noticed me, which I'm very shocked by, but they also won't expect this. First bear frozen on the island with Wally. Now freeze all the bears around the walrus. Hold on, I didn't fix all the ice. You're one step ahead of yourself, rescue police, if that is your real name. Okay, all we have to do for the walrus is defeat, well, freeze the polar bears just to keep him safe. And uh, Wally, I think you're good to go. Save a baby elephant? I'm in the savanna. It's hurt, so I have to save her. She's walking alone, so hurry up. She could get lost. She could also get infected, so you have to be really fast. Wait, we forgot to tell you, don't approach elephant family? Uh, okay. I was gonna try to go pet them. Are these elephants or hippos or Timon and Pumbas? Where's the elephant? I can't approach everybody. Wait, the longer that I take, the more infection the elephant has. Where is it? I can't tell. These look totally normal. Do you guys see these red particles? I'm gonna follow them and I hope that it could be the elephant. Oh, it was flowers? But it led me in the right direction. Hi, we're gonna help you, don't worry. Okay, we are in the elephant now to help with the infection. It looks like there is lava in his bone. Ouch, that sounds very, very painful. Luckily, we have sponges, so all we have to do is fill this gap with the sponge, and I think it should make him feel better. Here we go, here we go. 
He should feel better in no time. Hot potatoes, my feet are burning. How about this? Now use bandages to cover his wounds. Hey, we forgot to give you bandages. You'll have to make it yourself. Well, we cleared the infection. I think that's gonna be the hardest part. Where are the pandas? Oh, those are cactus. Just gonna swim over here carefully, carefully. All we have to do is grab a teeny weeny bit of sugar cane. I'm a little disappointed there's no uh, pandas over here, but whatever. We're going to make bandages out of paper. It's the best I know to do. Ella the elephant, we're going to do this together. I have acquired the sugar cane. Now let's make a crafting bin so I can get this beautiful elephant bandaged. And there we go. Three pieces of paper. Now, did it say to craft those together? Bandages, un- Breakable. Well, that's good, because this is an elephant. Here you go, Ella. Congratulations, you rescued the baby ele elephant. Ow, ow, hey, calm down. I just saved you. Save a baby pigeon? It's injured its wing. Wait, first of all, I'm getting teleported to all these places. I have not gotten to utilize the helicopter. I thought he'd be on the roof. I don't see him anywhere. Hello, at least give me a GPS, okay? What's in my inventory? Calcium cream, shrinking surgery potion, wings, and a ladder cannon. The typical everyday inventory. Oh my gosh, you guys, this has to be where we have to shoot the ladder cannon. And uh, if we mess up, this pigeon's life could be in danger. So very carefully sneak to the edge. Oh my gosh, I am afraid of heights. And shoot. Cool, but it's all the way down there. Fun, 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 fun stuff. Uh, you guys, before I make a very important jump, please look under this video and hit that subscription button. Three, two, one, go! Hey, it's working! Who needs wings when you can have a ladder cannon? I don't even know why I have those in my inventory. Would have been a lot simpler if they had an escalator though, I'm just saying. <gasps> Wait, I see him flapping just like the penguin right over here. How do I get over there? Oh, I have to use my wings. Do I look fabulous? I feel fabulous, thank you so much. You have to admit, he looks pretty darn good. Ah! Oh, no, 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 stop flying. I cannot fly like a pigeon apparently and make it out alive. You're so cute. We can't dilly dally. I have to use this uh, shrinking surgery potion. Use the calcium cream to heal the broken wing. I'm inside the pigeon now. We have calcium cream. I assume this is the part that's broken? Oh, it's on this side, poor baby. We have to think of a name for this pigeon, stat. Is that everything? <gasps> you healed the pigeon's wing. That was so easy. Pigeon flying ability. Great, am I having to teach a pigeon how to fly right now? I don't know how to fly. I'm very stressed. We've got this, we've kind of got this. Woo! Just barely. So I'm gonna go to this checkpoint right here. There she is. She is on her way to victory. You can do this. I feel so proud of myself. Like I'm technically a mother bird right now. I'm like Mary Poppins. Good job. Now we have to fly over here. This looks a little more difficult. Are you ready? I don't know that I am. Oh, this is a little difficult, but we can make it out of this. This is easy. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I got it on the first try. You made it. Awesome. You are 58% ready to fly. That is very specific. Now we have to go. How are we making it over there? We're going to have to take a pit stop. I'm pretty sure. A little bit of this and a little bit of this. Yes, we made it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see how far she can get. Oh, she didn't even have to stop. Okay, you showing off over your sister. Um, wait. Wait. I didn't do the last checkpoint. She flew away. I'm kind of sad. Baby penguin. It ate a fish and now it's choking. You need to be very fast about this one. Beautiful, beautiful penguin. I love you and you're a lot of people's favorite animals who are watching at home, probably. I'm just gonna use a sleeping potion on you. He's flapping and he's sleeping. That's impressive. All we gotta do is drink this beautiful shrinking potion and oh. I immediately got teleported into the trachea. We have a very, very quick countdown and uh, he could wake up at any moment. So I have tweezers and I have to find something stuck in his throat. Oh, is it this? This is gonna be a little hard because in order to get the bone out of his throat, I also may plummet to my death. Uh, plan this carefully, Brie. <sighs> it's because y'all are supportive back at home. Thank you so much. 
Now we can save the baby penguin. I rescued him. Save the whale. I am in Antarctica and I have to save a beach killer whale before it dries up. Wait, hold on. Why is the timer going? He's right there. He needs oxygen, Uh, water. I guess that's because he's out of the water. Here you go, Beluga. Let's get his oxygen level totally up before we do anything else. Of course, I was only given one bucket because we have to make it as inconvenient as possible. A lot of, a lot of running back and forth. I don't know that I can get him to 100%. We can only do one thing. We have to make a tool. Let's get iron ingot, gold blocks, and make a whale mover Yes, it's true. So we just need conveniently what's in my inventory, three blocks of gold, iron ingot, blocks of iron, and Flint, and there we have it, a whale o mover Use this vehicle at your own risk. Oh, jeez, guys, I don't have a license for this. I covered him in water, and apparently he's still a bit low on oxygen, so let's just fill him up a little bit more. Join the whale o mover It has been activated. Oh, so it looks like we're hurting him, but don't worry, we're not. I have to go on board and just slowly move him into the water. It's going to be fine. Get in there, get in there. Yay, congratulations, you rescued the killer whale. Now your mission is to treat the baby snail? Someone stood on him, so he needs help fast. Oh no, I don't blame somebody for stepping on him. I can't even find him myself. You brought me here to save. <gasps> well, yeah, he's camouflaged right in there, honey. You gotta, you gotta, you know, you, you gotta, you gotta sit somewhere else. His shell is cracked. I don't have anything in my inventory, so I'm hoping we're near a village. That is the only way we can help this baby snail. Oh, yes, there is one little hut that I hope does not contain a witch because then I may be attacked. Hello, doctor. Convenient. Hey, what are you doing in my house? I need help. We have very little time for Sheldon. Oh, you need help. How can I help you? A baby snail is in need of medical care, okay? This is very urgent. Wait, I'm a human doctor. I don't treat snails. Well, that is not very nice of you, okay? I personally would always operate on a snail. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. No, I really can't help you. This man is grumpy. You don't even have any patience in here. Okay, I can help your snail if you fulfill three favors for me. First, I'm really hungry, so get me some food. That seems unnecessary when you have a patient waiting, but shulk. Maybe some apples. We are by a lot of trees. That happened fast. These are magical trees. Every single leaf that I break has an apple in it. Oh, this is gonna be so easy now. I'm gonna make so much apple strudel if I even, I don't really know what apple strudel even is, but I'm gonna make a lot of it. Well, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. I don't wanna keep you away though, I need you. Apples again? Okay, it's really cold here, so can you cut some trees for me? You can find my ax in the chest. Can we just acknowledge the fact that there is a snail in need of urgent help and he's just making me do his chores? This doctor and I are not going to be friends. I'm just going to be honest. At least he has a diamond ax, so this shouldn't take as long. We need like a countdown on the screen because I don't know how long Sheldon is going to survive. He also didn't tell me how much to cut, so we're just gonna hope eight blocks of birch wood will be enough. Okay, now get me three water bottles and you are okay. I'm already okay. The snail is not okay. You are literally right next to an ocean pond. I don't know why I need to help you with this. Why is this urgent? Are you just really that thirsty? Okay, where is your snail? Over here, come on, come on, come on. Don't be slow. This snail is in need of urgent help. See him? See him? He's camouflaged right there. Don't step on him. Don't do it. Don't feed him coffee. What is that, a plunger? I can't even tell what that is. Why are you hitting his shell when it's already broken? Oh, there we go. It got fixed. He's better now. Congratulations, you rescued a baby snail. Your next mission is in the jungle. The baby chameleon has the rare disease where he always changes colors. You have to find out how to treat him or he could die? Guys, I thought all chameleons changed colors. Oh! He's so cute. Okay, he's, he's changing into the wrong color, it looks like. Because if you're in the forest or the jungle or tree area, you gotta be green. So we have a bug net, interesting, and a jar. This does not help me. How am I supposed to help this chameleon? Chameleon mini game. Stand on the wool. Uh, oh, okay. I don't know how to prepare for this. Red, red. Oh, I have three seconds. 
least I know my colors, guys. It's fine. Blue, purple. I guess this makes sense. We're having to like recalibrate the coloring. See, oh, look at this, guys. He turns the color that we're trying to match. So he's orange, so I stand on orange. He's green, so I stand on green. Yellow, hmm, I think he looked the best pink, personally, but that's also my favorite color. Easy, breezy, beautiful, cover chameleon. Oh, we're slowly filling the bar on the top, so it looks like he's almost saved. Maybe one more of these? Oh, <gasps> completed! He may be hungry now, so catch some flies for him. Oh, so flies just magically appear. Cool. These things are nasty. They're huge! How many should I get? I feel like five is a good amount. Come here. I just want this chameleon to eat you really fast. This chameleon's name, guys, is going to be Charles. I've decided. Oh, it got away. Don't fly over the ocean. This is inconvenient for me. Just have to coax them back. Looks like I'm gonna have to swim, ladies and gents. Three. Stop flying so fast. I rescued a baby chameleon. Wait, I didn't even go back and feed him yet. Save the pug. The pug got poisoned and we don't know how. Also, we're not sure in which room he is right now. So hurry up and find him. The longer I take, the more poisoned the pug is. This is awful. I hope he's in here. I'm just gonna take the stairs down. Are you in the chest? No? Awesome. Great. I'm gonna keep going. Uh, we don't have much time. It's already 7%. Second room. <gasps> there he is. Oh my goodness. He's so cute. Wait, he ate rotten flesh. That is never good for anyone. Radio, I need help. Hey, did you find out the poisoning cause? Rotten flesh. It's really bad, guys. Oh, rotten flesh? You have to find these ingredients to help him. Milk, bird eggshells, acorns, and honey. We are under a big time crunch, and I don't like this. Ah. Uh... Uh, I think we're gonna have to go outside, guys, unless there's something in here. Nope, I hope this is the outside. It's the outside. Where's a cow? Where's a cow? So I am behind the building and conveniently acorns are falling from the tree and there is a cow. It's like people have planned for this. Now, oh, beehive, beehive, easy peasy. Just gonna hit it a little bit. This could be very bad, guys. Ah! No, 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 no. No bees came out? It just gave me honey. I feel like I'm being pranked because that never happens. Now all I need is bird eggshells. Let's use this ladder because I think they have a tree house up here so we could get a very good view. Oh, I just got a bird egg in my inventory. Well, this should be good. Let's go back with the pug to make sure he's okay. He is 50% poisoned now, guys. So we gotta hurry. Place down this crafting bench as soon as possible, guys. Put it all together and you get an infection cure. Cure for rotten flesh poisoning. Ew, okay, I hope this baby pug never eats rotten flesh again, but he was probably hungry. I rescued the baby pug. So cute. Why, hello there. As you can tell by my outfit, I am channeling my nursing days and... Oh, 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 trapped pig. Poisoned pig needs your help. Pig will survive only three minutes? I thought I heard. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. I'm wasting time. I will save you. Gilbert, you're going to be okay. Pig is freed. Uh, mother spider returning? What is happening? This did not happen when I worked in the hospital, guys. Oh, I picked up the pig. Oh, this looks ridiculous. Let's place Gilbert down a little farther away, okay? Just just like that. Just There you go, bud. Just get off my head. <sighs> we are at the hospital. Don't worry. They, they make hospitals all the time in the middle, middle of the wilderness. Oh, we have books? Okay. Gilbert, survive. You only have a minute, 45 seconds. Oh my goodness. Milk, magma cream, water. Milk, magma cream, water. We have less than two minutes to save Gilbert. You know what, guys? In order to save him, please hit that like button beneath this video and he will be saved. Now what do we need? We need milk, milk. Only one more ingredient left. Let's go make this. Let's go make this antidote. One minute left, one minute left, one minute left. Uh, uh, uh. Antidote created, perfect. It is in our inventory, but uh, yes, I was gonna say we need to get it in his bloodstream. So we are currently in a vein, but we have to connect the veins to each other because otherwise you can't circulate. I feel like we just have to make these straight, right? And then everything is fine. Yay, okay, veins straightened. Now 
don't judge me for doing this, but I'm pretty sure you gotta take a vein and combine it with the antidote to create a cured straight vein. This is going to save Gilbert's life. Yay! Looky there. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. Hi! Now, Gilbert, I want to bond with you for a while. However, there's more animals to save. <gasps> Injured bee! You need to distract the others. Now, typically when I think of a bee, I don't think animal. I think insect. But that's neither here nor there. We've got to save him. Um, they, they're like circling around him and it's making me feel uncomfortable. What do I do? I don't see anything to distract him. Hold on. Let's look real quick. Oh, there's a friendly bear. Bears love honey, so this should distract him. Um, does he have an owner? Hello, sir. I just would like to steal your bear for a moment. Lug rat. Can I borrow your bear? It's probably something you're asked daily. Oh, sure. Okay, well, thank you, sir. You made it quite easy for me. Come here, bud. <gasps> I am holding an entire bear on my head. This, yeah, this this is already an interesting day for Bree. Okay, here we are. We're just gonna place this bear down here to distract the bees. Here you go, bud. Oh, oh, it's starting to work. It is starting to work. <gasps> are they stinging him? <sighs> Come here, little baby. I picked up the bee. I picked up the bee and we have to take him away. His wing is sticking out of my skull. What is happening? <laughs> Collect the pollen. Oh my gosh. We don't have much time, guys. I don't know if we can do it. Pollen remaining. I have quite a few more pollinations to grab. Um, apparently, if they have pollen, they glow. So that makes it easier for me. Now I'm missing a flower. Guys, I see a red flower up this hill. Now it's not yellow like all the other ones, but I feel like we're, we're in luck. We're, I just have to figure out how to get up here. We can do this. <gasps> yes! Yay! All pollen found. Give it to injured bee. Yes. Uh, I lost him. <gasps> there he is. Oh, that made me nervous. All I have to do is give her some nectar. And she's healed. Oh, okay. Why are you leaving me? Beatrice, I just cured you, okay? Be grateful. Give me a hug. Okay, well, let's save the bear from the bees. He's friendly. Stop being mean to him. I'm taking him back. This just looks absolutely ridiculous. Oh, oh, it growled. I, I feel like he's becoming unfriendly. There you go. Why is he levitating? He has four eyes. No, okay. Guys, look from this direction. Does he not look like he has four eyes? Slug rat, you can take back your bear. Ah, no problem. You can repay me by helping my dog. Wait, what? You got a bear. Why do you have a dog? A rabid wolf in the forest bit my poor dog's leg. I'm worried it's infected. I have to kill bacteria. Um, where, where's your dog, sir? Oh, is this him? He looks fine. Nope, nope, he has a hurt leg. Magical stethoscope time. Icky, Icky, I, so I think we're in the rib cage. I have an antibody grenade and also a medical ray gun. Guys, before we clear out these germs, if your subscription button is the color of this red wall, please make it gray. Oh, so it destroys the bacteria. Look at this. Ah, I think, I thought it did. Why, why? Calm down, calm down. I'm just trying to kill you. It's not a big deal, okay? This, there's a lot going on right now, okay? I'm spam clicking a little too much. We gotta calm down. They keep spawning from over here. So I think I know what I must do. I think there's a spawner over here, which requires a grenade. Oh, I clicked the grenade down and didn't even have to run. I just sat in an explosion. But that's okay because Rufus the third is okay. Yes, I know it's a very original dog name. Bye, Rufus. Okay, it is very rainy and cold. I've been brought here for a reason, I'm sure. Uh, what's in my inventory? A portable medical base. Well, great, but I there's not even an animal here to help. This looks like it could house an animal, I'm not gonna lie. I always say when I see a hole in the ground, avoid it. There could be a snake in there. Okay, I know I just gave you that advice, but I'm going down the hole. Just watch me do it in Minecraft. Just don't do it in <gasps> real life. The baby bunny is down here. Oh, I am so glad that I came up here. That was so sad. It's raining and he couldn't get out. He also can't get out of my head. Why does this keep happening? Hmm, let's see. Let's take him a little bit away from the trees so I can place my medical base. Whoa. Can we just take a moment to realize I carried that thing in my pocket? I am superwoman. I have been strong. I've lifted a bear. I carried a house. And there he is. Guys, look at how cute this rabbit is. 
What's wrong with him though? Like, I don't, I don't know what's wrong. He's not telling me anything. There's not anything above his head. Well, let's turn on the heater. There we go. Cause he's obviously cold. He needs to be blow dried. Success, the rabbit is warm, but he still looks a little rough. Oh, I know, let's go rebuild his house. We have a lot in here. We have a diamond shovel, a pickaxe, and 60 buckets. Is there that much water down here? That's a little concerning. Just get a little bit of water out, you know, easy. That was easy. See, I, I don't know why I was given these supplies because am I supposed to burrow even deeper? Is it, I, why was I given these? You know, here's a little covering situation. I don't, I've never been a rabbit before. I don't know exactly what it needs. Hopefully that works. It's not flooding anymore. Burrow repaired. Wait, let's take a look. Make sure. Wait for the rabbit to return home. Oh, oh, Fufu, Fufu, are you? Oh, he's all good. I appreciate your service. Wait, what, what did I do? Did he just hug me? I feel like I have been hugged by a rabbit. This is the best day of my entire life. So I have been brought to the next location and in my inventory, I have a trapdoor cannon, a stethoscope and sleeping powder. I have absolutely no idea what's going on. <gasps> Wait, I see something glowing up here. Llama injured. You need to help it. I'm aware we were already helping the llama with its drama, okay? Come on, we can do this. We're gonna take it one step at a time because Brie can be a little slow with this, guys. I'm aware, no need to tell me. Oh my goodness, he is a little far away. A little too far if you do ask me. <gasps> there we go, there we go. I think I understand how to do this now. I've actually never made a staircase with trap doors before. Guys, we're almost there. We are so close. Woo! Okay, we are finally with the drama llama and we uh, have to help you. You have a hurt legged. That's extra fancy. If you have a leg, we gotta fix that. So we're gonna use our handy dandy sleeping powder. Oh, wait, yo, this thing is about to fall off the side of the hill. We gotta hurry. We don't need more injuries around here. Heal the llama, disinfect the wounds. Okay, so in our inventory, we have a disinfectant sponge, a skin cell gun, and a bandage. So if my nursing skills are correct, you need to disinfect, 2% done here, use the skin cell gun, and then bandage. I think that should be the order that we need. Disinfect, skin cell gun, and bandage. This really isn't too bad, except we need to make this 100%, so it may take a sec. Guys, we are already 62% done. Oh, we have a long way to go, though. It looks like we got some parkour to deal with. You know what? Let me go up this parkour to get a little bit of the higher places. Oh, 82% done. Guys, comment down below if you have ever broken a bone like this llama. I actually haven't, thank goodness. Knock on wood. 96% done. Guys, we are almost done healing Ethel. Yes, wound cleaned. Bad cells remaining, 15. So we have to repair the rest of the cells. I'm assuming that means the rest of these guys. They've been cell gunned and now bandage. Bandage, no, put on final bandages. Thank you, yes, we only have uh, two more, I think. <gasps> there they are, there they are. One more, and then one and done. Yay, that's exciting. <gasps> Llama's feeling better. Well, soon it won't, because I'm standing directly on it. Well, Ethel, we have to move on to the next animal. <laughs> But first, I gotta get out of here. So uh, good for us. We have a portable trampoline. Let's place it down. I hope it sticks. <gasps> Three, two, one. Oh, the llama went first. So we have been transported to Farmer, Bra Farmer Brown. Are you all right? Save the chicken. Chicken barn is on fire. Oh my goodness. Hold on, you guys. One of my favorite things in the entire world is chuckles and chuckles could soon be a piece of kfc fried chicken we gotta hurry uh magical stethoscope where's a bucket where's a bucket yo where's a bucket i'm going in your house i'm sorry you've got to have one in here right farmer brown you have let me down i need to find a bucket asap asap this is not a drill oh <gasps> there it is he just left his bucket by the river required bucket Fire will soon be under control. Oh no, I have to run back and forth, don't I? This is too much exercise and stress at one time. Oh my goodness, I don't even see the chicken. I hope this gets the last one. Yes, successfully put out the fire. Now, oh, wait, he looks kind of cute. He looks like a little Dalmatian, but we need to save him. Ah, 
this this is terrifying. Like, I, I love him so much, but like, I am like inside the chicken, but I see a large chicken. What is happening? So it looks like he has burns. Do I place water on the burn? Oh, okay, good, good. That was actually what I was supposed to do. I'm a little shocked. Is this his little belly? Is oh, He doesn't have feathers anymore. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, baby chicken saved. I did it. Rebuild the coop. Yo, what was that? Why did something growl at me? This was not part of my job description. I'm just saying. I do have all the materials that I should need. First, let's start with stairs. Have to get in here somehow. Oh no, that was backwards. We only have 43 seconds. Why am I being timed? We have stairs. We need um here. I'm making some sort of wall. I don't know that this is correct, but I wasn't shown the floor plan, guys. We only have 15 more seconds. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Uh, here? Uh, let's be real. It's Farmer Brown. I, I don't feel like he's gonna care, right? It's fine. Yeah, see? It's completed. Honestly, it doesn't look that bad. Ew, ew, what is that sound? There's a flopper. There's something flopping over here. Is it a frog? <gasps> it's a fish. Fish out of water. That's, the fish needs help. Well, conveniently, I have an Ozarka water bottle, which will give you a, a little bit, right? Here you go. Rescue the fish, build a new pond. I, I tried, where'd the water go? He absorbed the water. Okay, we have to get crafting here, ladies and gentlemen. First, let's build a shovel start building our pond and I need to build a bucket. So let's put this down, this down. Guys, we've got this. Wooden shovel, here we go, and a bucket. So we can start creating the pond. Uh, let's go for three by three. One, two, three, one, two, three. Dig, dig, dig. Now let's get some water. Oh, there's a pond over here. This is stressful. There we go. Oh no, you don't, sir. The bear is back. Ah, uh, that means we need to get a fishing rod. Here, there's a house. They've got to have something over here. If you live on the lake, you've got to have a fishing pole. That's just like a rule. Everyone knows. <gasps> here we go. 32 seconds. We can do this. We have to just snatch the fish out of the bear's claws. Here we go. Here we go. We can do this. Did I get him? Did I get him? Oh! <gasps> Wait, oh, I got him. Fish caught, bring to safety. I literally thought the bear was about to eat us both. Let's really quickly return him to his environment and the seventh and final animal has been saved. 